Yeah, let's do some reading. Um, I know I started. I thought I started one. I guess not. Be knowledgeable about internet crimes. That won't get my knowledge up. Um, such a pain for anyone in the flower industry. I mm, thorough analysis, battling, helps your baseball skills. Film buffs. This one I feel like it'll raise my uh what my stats I get when I watch movies. Got a book of sweets found within Chinatown. I want something that actually helps me. And I guess I'm just gonna read I'm gonna get knowledge. Yeah. <laughs> you gonna use the store for something? Make sure you close up. Well, don't leave a mess, I'm heading home. Okay. Good or evil, the threat on Majid can be felt all over the world. What are your thoughts? It's dangerous to fight in the internet world too, it seems. Can I finish reading the book right now? Nope. Hey, hey! Mm, I don't realize how long you've been reading, so how hard did you get? Nope. Seems like you still have some pages left. You should continue some other time. I guess. I could have studied, you know, and gotten some knowledge, but I feel like reading the books I get uh, like substantial increases as opposed to just regular, just, oh, I'm gonna study. I don't know if you can hear my dog in the background. He's going crazy out there. All right, what do people say? People went to a Mentos. <gasps> I can handle with Makoto. Let's find out. Let's find out if she's at, she's not at the school. Oh wait, she's at the school. She's not gonna go up though. Oh, Cammy's not even gonna go up. Hmm. I guess let's just. It's raining too. Who wants to hang out? Oh, where I go, Makoto? What are you doing today? Are you doing? Yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's. Let me see. Let's go right now. Let's just go and try to get her up a little bit. Oh, girl, I can't leave you here all alone by yourself in the rain. Well, all you do now is wait. Yo, Greg! Thanks for the host, bro. Alright. Do you think you can help me with broadening my bees? I don't think my bond with Makoto will deepen just yet. I, I I know it's not gonna raise right now, but I can get it closer. What will you do? Alright, what should we want? Let's go so let's broaden our views. Shall we go? Oh. So if I picked fun, I could have chosen where I wanted to go. What's going on, bro? Are you at work? It seems like Makoto is enjoying herself. She made a new discovery today, and she liked that. Okay, let's give her a gift. I'm not going to give her any sweets, because I, she might like the glass vase. It's a palm-sized, colorful vase made of glass. She might like this. Let's give it to her. For me? Mm. Thanks. It's the thought that... No! She didn't like it. No! But it'll grow, it'll grow stronger soon, so it doesn't matter. Let's go home. Oh wait, yeah, no, it is Saturday, huh? God dang, I'm, I'm losing track of time now. I am, I am going crazy. Ah, uh, you're back. Okay, who wants to hang out with me right now? I can hang out with Sojiro. Another report from me. I have another report to make. Do you have a bit of time? Oh, he's gonna grow stronger soon too. No, but I want to read. All right, let's get, the, let's get, let's see if we can get him closer. Let's hang out with them. Thanks. Sorry to bug you when you're busy. Am I down next weekend for accessibly playing Monster Hunter? Hell yeah! Of course. Of course, I'm so done. I just, right, I just today, I went and I reserved and paid it off because I'm gonna go pick it up on Thursday night. Um, that and Dragon Ball. Oh, Kurusu, I've been waiting for you. I have more I want to say about how I, I'm helping you guys. Come on, let's, let's go somewhere going. close then. Sorry. Oh, sorry, one sec. The ladies are calling me. That was from oh, that's not a lady. That was from Akiyamaku. He said he wants to stop by. Apparently, he's pretty close. It's not serious. Um, I don't think we should ignore him. Can you come with me? But yeah, man, I, like I'm, I'm, I'm up for a, a, a all-day session of uh, Monster Hunter if you want. Akiyamaku. Mishima. Ah. There's our guy. 
Look, Akiyamaku said he's not gonna be able to pay up this month. How about you spot him? That's what friends are for, right? F friends? Huh? You guys ain't friends. Don't try mess with us, Akiyama. Is this loser supposed to be the friend who's gonna help you? Uh. If you don't got anything to do with this little bitch, Akiyama, I suggest you get out of here. Come on, Toru. Looks like we're just gonna have to go have a nice chat with that girlfriend of his. P please no. I'm begging you. Sorry, but you broke our promise. Now she's gonna be the one to pay us back. If you catch my drift. <laughs> this is just what you get for trying to screw us over. Uh, oh wait, no, that's Toru. Wait, Toru. Which one's Toru? That was a blonde one, right? <laughs> oh, I know. Akiyama. Uh, you're so cruel, Yuda-kun. <sighs> Yama-kun. Kurusu, run. What? I'm not leaving. You crazy? What are you going to do? <laughs> I'm not sure. I can't just abandon Akiyama-kun, though. I think I have an idea. It's risky, but it might just work. If anything happens to me, take care of Akiyama-kun, Kurusu. <laughs> hey, 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 you guys! Guys? Crap, I bit my tongue. Huh? I, huh? Are you still here? Run away, you idiot. Uh, um, you better lay off Akiyama-kun. I've been taking a video of this whole conversation. Huh? If you do anything to Akiyama-kun or his girlfriend, I'll bring it straight to the police. Oh, and don't get any ideas about breaking my phone. It backs up to the cloud automatically. Hey, what should we do? We'll be fine. The police ain't gonna do shit because of a stupid little video. Why don't you run along home to your anime girls? Why don't you... You, we don't got time to deal with losers like you. Uh, you gonna take that? <laughs> uh, believe in yourself, bro. Kurusu, you're right. Uh, eh? What the hell? Looks like, look, I know you guys are supposed to be tough and all, but are you sure it's really worth getting arrested again over something like this? I mean, this video is definitely enough to get you guys busted, even your, given your previous criminal records. Uh, wait, hold on. God dang it, which one was Yuda? Was that the normal guy? How'd you know about that? Whatever, I'm giving them both the snaky voice. Doesn't matter how. Just leave Akiyama-kun alone, and we'll be even. Then if you keep your word, I'll delete the video with the backup too. You'll delete them now! No! Uh, Yudakun? Yeah, I've had enough of this shit. <sighs> Man, I thought I was gonna have a heart attack. My whole act would have broken down if they didn't back off when they did. <laughs> I really suck, huh? You were super cool, bro. Hmm? You think? Even if I peed in my pants a little? <laughs> No, probably not, bro. Yeah, that big wet stain would kind of killed it. The truth is, I've dealt with enough bullying to know guys like that have probably been arrested at least once. <laughs> oh, and thanks for sticking by me, Kurusu. We can't let injustice like that go unchecked. I think I get it now. This feeling is what made me want to help you guys to begin with. That's why I started the fan site, to make sure that nobody has to go through stuff like this again. Mishima seems extra determined. His determination is off the chart. But he doesn't get anything till rank 10, so. We've got All two right. more. <sighs> Akiyama kun, are you okay? Looks like they really laid it on you. Mishima, why'd you help me? Huh? You didn't need to get involved. Sorry. Sorry. It looked like you were really in trouble though, so I stepped up. That's so. Anyway, can you walk? Do you need us to call an ambulance? 
I'm fine. Just go. Oh, all right. Come on, Kudasu. Well, see you later. Yep, I came like I got what I came for to get my rank up. Oh, come on, Futaba. You need to stop sleeping for like two weeks, girl. Stop getting that. Get out of that coma and help me out. Okay. Let's see what people did today. They hang out with Anne, Yusuke, and Takemi. Stole the treasure. Man, people waited till the last minute to do that. Uh, let's see. Who wants to hang out with me today? <gasps> Anne! Oh, Yuki reporting. Oh, yeah, Yuki reporting in. This one's important. Apparently, this post was made by someone with ties to the banks in the finance sector. The target this time is a guy who never pays back his loans. Sounds like he might be involved in organized crime, too. He could be dangerous. Sounds interesting. Right? Apparently, even the police have had trouble catching him. He keeps changing his name and appearance to elude them. I guess he ba he's basically the man with a hundred faces. Not bad, huh? According to one particular post, his current he's currently going by the name Fumio Akitsu. I went ahead and made a warning post about it. Is that okay? Either way, I'm sure it'll be easy for the Grunties. Oh! Hell yeah! Let's discuss whether it got- okay, yeah. The man with many faces and deaths. I don't know if that's something I can do now, but let's see if Anne... Let's see, what are we doing today? Let's see. Uh, let's go right away. Let's just see if I can raise it right now. What's up, girl? We'll just have to wait for now. I oh, yeah. I don't think my- oh, crap. Okay, okay, let's not... Let's just see if Makoto's oh, on the map too right bad. Now. Yusuke? Of course Yusuke's ready to level up. He's always ready because I keep ignoring him. <sighs> but if I hang out with Anne and I can give her more food, she's gonna really love it. Alright, you know what? Let's hang out with Yusuke. He's always in the underground walkway. Let's let's just let's just give him one. So he shuts up. And uh that way he's just he's just up there. So he's catching up just a little bit. Where is he? He's always in a corner somewhere. Not in this corner. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Alright, Yusuke. Today's your day, bro. I'm giving you today. All we have now is to do is wait. What a nerve-wracking time. By the way. Meanwhile, I deserve the public. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's came, I came to see you, bro. <laughs> yes, I got a wealth of free time. Just accept it. It will grow stronger. Let's, let's hang out. I'm in your debt. Okay. All right. Now then, our destination is Inoshik, Inokashira Park. Let's go. Oh, Thank why you. am I in a boat with him? Thank you for your assistance today. After all, it would be impossible to sketch while rowing. Uh, I should bring a girl here. What? Girl? Does that mean you have a girlfriend? You should have mentioned sooner. I have missed the opportunity for a truly wonderful subject. That aside, I must thank you for your help today. This is the ideal location for my next motive. Motif? Motive. Look at all the ducks, they're so cute. <laughs> Don't get so excited, you'll fall off, you know. Hmm. Perfect. That's it. That is it. My previous painting captured only one aspect of the heart. Desire. As such, I was unable to arrive at a truly authentic representation. That is why I've come today. I shall paint a, sec a second aspect. The burning passion between men and women. <laughs> Fittingly, our theme today will be the wonders of love. You will have an important role to play here as well today. While I draw, ensure the boat remains as steady as possible amid these devilish ripples. Um... <laughs> ah, this angle. <laughs> Incredible. That bashful side profile. Those moist eyes. Their overflowing passion is wholly evident. They are akin to Adam and Eve. Yet in time, all lovers must come to know the pain of separation. 
Separation is the natural end to any relationship. But even beyond that, love endures. Precisely. This is the truth of the human heart. <laughs> it will make the most wonderful painting. It shall be adored by all who gaze upon it. It may even be... Oh, hold on. It may even be given top prize in the next exhibition. Wait. Now is not the time to be thinking of such trivial matters. Hey. Can you please remain still? Huh? Return to your prior eight. <laughs> <laughs> Will you guys please stay still? I mean, I know you guys don't know that I was painting you, but can you guys stay still? Damn it! I must capture your profile. How dare you move? What the hell are you doing? Rejoice, for I shall preserve your beautiful love that all my, that all coming generations may bask in its glory. Once I complete this painting, you will become new legends in the art world. A modern Adam and Eve. Legends? Art? This dude's off his rocker. Come on, let's report him. Hold on a sec. Are you drawing us? Wait, are you using us as models? Yes. A man and woman in intimately swaying in a dinghy of dreams. The blush of their cheeks. The bashful looks. Yes. This is the love I was so empathetically searching for. Love? Uh, I guess you could call it that, but it's kind of weird. It's familial love. This here's my sister. Whoops! <laughs> uh, I told you I didn't want to come here with you. The only ones who do this crap are stupid couples. But I always dreamed of coming here to Tokyo and writing about here. I thought it was supposed to be with my boyfriend, not my brother. How could this be? Familial? So that overflowing passion was just a figment of my imagination. It seems my bias has caused me to overlook the truth of the matter. <laughs> Love comes in all forms. Okay. Maybe you should train more. You have a wild event. Love comes in all forms. <laughs> Love is broad, multi-faced, fat, or multi-faceted beast. This only serves to prove how narrow my pres my perspective can be. I see. Hmm. Romantic love and familial love. The two may be nigh indiscernible, depending on one's point of view. Hmm. Perhaps the truth of the heart lies in the eye of the beholder. Al Zero, I feel as though I've learned something today. I guess that's his quiet resolve. How about next time we don't get into a boat together? Hey, you got the artist talk. Chance to step in the shadows. Yeah. All right. He's only rank four. Wait, so only couples write these things, right? That means those two. Shh. There are people from all walks of life here in the city. Oh, tell me more. What are they talking about? Let us return home. Ah, well, come. It's about time we return home. Please row us back to shore, our zero. Me? See you. You bastard, you can help. Rain, huh? Just a few degrees. He's just complaining about, like, all that stuff. Okay, let's see. What did people just do? Uh, they worked at all the stuff. They read. They watched the DVD. They were at the time Kawakami, Oya, EY. So they see with the Kaw Kawakami thing. I think that I think I've reached the max that I can with her. And so I have to wait till whatever point in the story where she decides to be like, okay, you know, I'll hang out with you. I just gotta wait for her. I guess her email. Um. So you know what? We're just gonna read. Let's finish that book. Make sure you're close. Alright, I'm heading home. Yeah, I'm gonna finish this book and get my knowledge up. Do you have virus protection? Introducing the new software. Newest. What are your thoughts? Just danger the foot in the internet world too, it seems. I don't know, it seems like Medji could bypass anything if they could just like explode your oh. stuff. So you finished reading Medjid Menace? 
They were like gentlemen thieves targeting evil corporations, but now they're just glory-seeking hackers. They're sort of like us phantom thieves in that nobody knows exactly who they are. That section on computer security was difficult, but I'm sure you gained some knowledge from it. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Get that up there. Alright. <sighs> well, I guess we should keep go to sleep. Staying up too late isn't healthy, you know. Yes, I know, Morgana. I know that you just love to make me go to sleep when I don't want to. God, we still have all this free time. But I should be approaching... This is like two days left right now. It's one day. Oh, yeah, the last day to hang out. Okay. Uh, how's my health? No. No. Let's see, what do people do today? Uh, oh, can I hang out with Makoto? Can I get hers up before? Let's see, Ryuji? No. <gasps> Makoto! Yes! School gates! I'm coming, girl. I'm coming to hang out with you. I cannot get there any faster. Uh, well... How can you not wait? Are you available? I'd like to talk to you about Aiko. Yes. Yes, I would. I would like to hang out with Makoto. That was my favorite ask. Shall we go? Let's get a drink before we talk. Oh, yeah, girl. Whatever you want to drink, I'll get it for you. Oh, we can take the back entrance into the school. She wants to hang out in the Actually... School. Apparently, Aiko started dating a host from a club near her work. I guess he, um, hit her, hit on her one day after her shift, and that was that. Since then, he's only, th he's the only thing she'll talk about. She even sent me a picture of the date at Destinyland. Uh, are you jealous of them? Hmm. He's not a problem as long as she's happy. But knowing the line of work her boyfriend is in, I'm worried that he might deceive her. For now, it seems that he hasn't forced her to spend any money at his club, but I'm still nervous. Beyond that, he calls her his princess and constantly tells her how special she is. It makes me sick to my stomach. I don't know. It sounds like you're kind of jealous. You'd be happy if I started calling you princess. Biker refuses to listen to me. She said the idea that all hosts are bad, pe are bad people is outdated. She even said that she was shocked to be getting Evan advice from someone who would totally flunk a test about love. Huh. Tests about love aren't a thing, though. Even if they were, I most certainly wouldn't flunk them. Sorry about that. I'm probably just being biased towards him. I mean, I don't have any proof that he's untrustworthy. But that's why I wanted to meet him and find out for myself what kind of person he really is. And if there's not too much to ask, I'd like you to accompany me on this excursion as well. Uh, well... This time, um, you have to play the role of my boyfriend. Oh, yeah. Oh, I got this, girl. <laughs> Only if I can take it serious. Oh, ooh, that's a good one, too. I got... Oh... Oh, 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 I want, I want to, I want these two. They're so good. I want them. I want to answer to both. Only if I can take it seriously. I feel like this will get her. This will be like she'll be like perfect. But I feel like this one's like the Makoto girl. Let me, let me, uh, let me serious for serious girl. Be my girlfriend. Only if I can take it seriously. Hmm? How do you mean? Oh, I see. You see, she worried about Aiko's shoe. Okay, she liked that. Whatever. That's very kind of you. No. I'm gonna pretend like I am your boyfriend, girl. Think I have a boyfriend? Aiko might be more inclined to listen to me. Actually. To tell you the truth, I actually made plans with her and her boyfriend for a double date. Sorry. But it's just going to be at a diner. Nothing particularly fancy, I promise. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. You're a tremendous help. I'm so glad you agreed to this. I don't know who else I'd ask if you had to know. Since Makoto's trusting me. No! I want to see what the date is going to be like. Alright. No, I want to go on the date. When is it? Aiko, I hope she's not getting herself wrapped up in anything dangerous. But just in case, I'll try looking for some info on that house. Oh. Alright then. Oh, I don't know. I wanted to go on that date with Makoto. I guess that's the next one. <clears throat> well, then. I made a promise with Futaba, right? I'm sure she'll pull through. Okay, yeah, this is the last night, so. How was Futaba? 
I haven't heard anything. Dude, this ain't some normal oversleeping. Over, eh, oversleeping stuff. Our deadline is tomorrow. If Utaba's not up by then. But she can. But can she really do anything even if she doesn't wake up? Honestly, I'm not sure. Either way, our only option is to put our trust in her. That's right. Yeah. If she's, there, if she's been asleep all this time, do you think she's having some kind of long dream? Hmm. Dreams are said to be the sort of memories, after all. She surely needs ample time to face her troubled past. Her past? Do you think she's really facing all that shit right now? If that's the case, she would probably need a great amount more time to do so. Considering how she had us wrapped around her finger, it feels as though she'll be able to pull it off. Uh, I believe in Futaba. Yes. In indeed. Well, just give us the ring if anything changes. We're counting on you. I have to agree with Makoto. Who knows how this thing might turn out? Alright, last the last day to hang out before Futaba becomes available. Oh! They all want to hang out. Let's see, who, who can level up right now, though? No, not Kawakami. Uh, Yoshida. Wait, no. <gasps> Hifumi? Yeah, I think I was Hifumi. Let's get, let's get another Persona up. I mean, another Confidant ability. What's up, girl? Good evening. Good evening, Kurusukun. It's even hotter this summer. I know, it's so hot, girl. You have more ap aptitude for this than I imagined. I'm also sensing an ambitious spirit within you. I should have taken into account your improvement throughout our lessons. I have something in mind, but let's play a match first. In fact, let's play it right now. I feel like my bond is gonna go so good right now. Let's go. Um. After we finish this match, let's go to the secondhand bookstore. <laughs> that was a good match. I really do enjoy teaching you. You're such a quick learner. Today I thought we'd find you something to help train you on your own. This bookstore is filled with jogi related books. I've been coming here a lot lately. There's also a curry restaurant just around the corner. I recommend their katsu curry. I always eat katsu curry before an important match. For good luck. Man, I want to try some authentic curry so much. <clears throat> hey, Fumi. Oh. Hello. I hope your match went well today. Oh, I yeah, know. <clears throat> What are you talking about? Today's our day off. My apologies. I forgot that there are any matches scheduled for today. Out shopping with your boyfriend? How how nice for you. I shouldn't be surprised. You are a you are a famous juggy player after all. Well, I won't introduce you. Bye. Sorry. Sorry, she was only glaring at you because you're with me. She's my senior. I defeated her in a recent title match. Uh, must have been the curry katsu. <laughs> she has a bad vibe. That's not true. She's very friendly to everyone but me. The truth is, I'm not very liked by my seniors. The more attention I get, the more enemies I make, and the more lies are spread about me. Oh. Perhaps it's odd to compare myself to them, but I wonder if it's the same for the Phantom Thieves. People are still divided about them on the internet. Some love them, while some others hate them. I can't help but see similarities between us. What do you think about them? Um... They're cool. I feel the same way, actually. Yeah, she liked that. It's amazing that they're still not doing what they do, even though so many people criticize them. They give me courage. But their victories can't be won with will alone. How do they change a person's heart? I'm interested from a tactical standpoint, and I'm sorry, but we really got, uh, we quite got off topic. I feel like I've become much more talkative as of late. I usually don't talk this much. You're more than just someone I can practice new moves with. You're someone I can confide in. I look forward to it. Okay, girl. Um, if you don't mind this sort of thing, I'd like to go out and chat with you again. I feel Hifumi's trust in me growing. I can feel my hair, I'm growing. <laughs> Alright. Oh, yes. There's a book that I love for you to read. Let's go. Let's go. Until next time. I love how they just, they'll say one thing and that's the only voice act part. Okay, today's the day. 
Come on, Futaba. Get up, girl. I need you to do your thing to stop measured. Oh, yeah, look at this double load screen. Come on, Futaba. Isn't today our deadline for dealing with Medjed? Yep. Futaba's still asleep, too. This won't be good. Hey. Uh. <laughs> I would say how's Futaba, but it's really more about, um, he's just saying hey. So I feel like it'd be like, hey, how's Futaba? Not, hey, what's up? There's something I came to do. Today's the day Wakaba passed. I do this every year. Uh... Here, I've got a cup for you too. Futaba reminds me so much of her mother. She's a smart girl. Doesn't just go with the flow either. Wakaba. <clears throat> Your work and your kid were so fulfilling for you. Why'd you have to die so suddenly? That reminds me. You saw me talking to that prosecutor. I mean, I mean that woman in the suit, right? I remember you were real bothered by it. She might come back, so I guess I should tell you about it. That woman was trying to get information on Wakaba's research out of me. That's what we heard in the palace. You don't need to know what the research was about. Just know there was some trouble around it. Obviously, Wakaba got dragged into that as well. Now, they ruled her death as suicide. But I've got my doubts. Oh, yeah. I, oh, I don't doubt that she got... Someone bumped her off. Someone... That was not suicide. Someone killed her. <clears throat> doubts? Could she have been killed? Yes. Supposedly, there were people who wanted to take her research and use it for their own benefit. Don't get me wrong, though. I don't have a lick of evidence. That's why I haven't told Futaba any of this. I don't want to cause her any more trouble. It sounded like she had suspicions of her own based on what she said in the palace. Still, there's one thing I regret. It was right before Wakaba died. She told me, I think I might die. I brushed it off thinking it was just a joke. But if I had just taken her seriously... <sighs> that's another reason I took Futaba in. Redemption. She went through such horrible things. <clears throat> Those heartless adults just yelled at the poor girl. Hey, how do you heal emotional scars? Time? Heal on their own. I agree. I'm waiting for it to happen, but Futaba. Hey, she's awake. She's alive. It's cold. Uh, uh huh. <clears throat> you can't sell this. Never mind that. But how did you get here? Uh, I walked. You're okay? Was that bad? Th that's not it. I'm just shocked to see you out of the house. Uh, I'm sorry I worried you. <laughs> it's all right. By the way, what's the date today? Uh, it's, uh, it's the 21st. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Uh, you know, the clans. Medjid? We waited for you. Uh, I'm gonna just say Medjid. <clears throat> oh, that's it. Let's take care of it now. Come. Oh, wherever you want me to go, girl, I'll follow you wherever. I know, I'm easily swayed. <laughs> Girl says, come here. I'm like, sure. 
Fast forward. It's my turn to help out. <laughs> Medjed. Now how do we cook them? I just want to be like, um, <clears throat> Fujaba, you might want to get like some, some uh, air freshener in here or something. It's kind of rank in here. Uh, eliminate them. Violent much? No, shush. <laughs> hey, Futaba, we don't have much time left. Are you sure you could do this? The, the kitty talked? Is this a dream? I'm going back to sleep. It is not a dream. Get up! Say something! Uh, I'll explain later. Right. Now hurry it up! Eh, I guess it doesn't matter. Let's get cracking. You're just tapping away over there. Are you sure this will work? Mm -hmm. Hey, Futaba! <laughs> I don't think she can hear me. Talk about intense concentration. This place is so messy. I'm surprised she could focus at all. Utaba, you should really clean your room a bit. Huh. She's not listening. Oh well. Just waiting around is boring. Let's clean the place up. What? She literally has bags of trash just thrown in her room. I love that I'm, I'm cleaning for her. What? No. It looks a little better now, don't you think? No, no way. No, uh-uh. I don't believe that. <clears throat> well, Futaba, we're done on our end. Are you finished yet? <laughs> she can't hear a word I'm saying. <sighs> Guess we'll just have to keep waiting. Okay, that would have taken at least an hour or two, maybe, depending on how fast he cleaned up. But you gotta pick up all that stuff, you gotta throw away all that trash. No, I don't believe it. Uh, yo, I believe that it's evening, yes. I'm done! Whoa! Oh! I love that shirt she has. I love that Tetris shirt. That's cool. Uh, what's up? Something happened? It's finished. Finished? What is? It's so clean. Why? <laughs> Why is my who who dare clean my room? We cleaned it. Anyway, is it true? Did you really take care of Medjed? I handled them, and someone else handled my room. I don't understand, but this is good. Futaba? Hey, Futaba, what's wrong? <sighs> She's sleeping. Well, it looks like it's been taken care of. I guess we should get home and sleep, too. Oh, Futaba has such a cute sleep sound. Oh, more of this. Oh, who cares? So, Futaba's awake? Awesome! And how's Med has Medjid been taken care of? Er, more importantly, how's Futaba doing? Uh, she's in her futon. Seriously? She must have been quite exhausted. I can't say I blame her at all. If Medjid's been affected, it surely will make the news. That should be enough to confirm whether or not the deed has been done. Then why don't we all watch the news together? Yes, well we should meet up at La Blanca as usual. See you guys tomorrow. We should be in the clear now, right? Maybe. Can't even. Can't even what's it called? Like, you even get to do anything. Wait! Yes! I'm not sure. No! Oh, you. Oh, you tease! Oh, why didn't you just skip to the next day if you weren't gonna. If you were just go to sleep? Watch. Can I do anything? No, let's do that tomorrow. Shut up, Morgana. Oh, my plant. Come on. I don't have any nutrients and it's starting to look better too, but it's dying. Damn it. <sighs> okay, we're gonna we're just gonna have to trust Futaba. Let's get some sleep. Yeah, let's go to sleep. We got no other choice.
Well, at least we got Futaba, so now the next part of the story should be kicking in soon. I'm still on my vacation, though. Hey, your friends are here. Hurry down. Boss, hello. So you're finally up, huh? Don't slack off just because you're on summer vacation. Why? That's the best time to slack off. Yo, you look tired. No, I'm not. I have plenty of rest because Morgana. We've made ourselves at home. Late last night, it was discovered that someone has tampered with the hacker group Medjid's website. The site's main page now displays what is thought to be the mark belonging to the Phantom Thieves. More so, the personal information of a Japanese man, a possible Medjid member, was illegally publicized. Aren't these the guys people have been up in arms about? Medjid has yet to issue an official reply. Furthermore, their previously announced cleanse of Japan has remained unimplemented for now. Some speculate that they have taken this series of events seriously and ultimately canceled their plan. Yeah! Yeah! yeah. Pyramid of Rat Collapses! I don't know what that is. Show it to me first. Oh god, my freaking... My Dissidia thing is going off. What are smirking about? I need to change that. <laughs> uh, nothing. Well, stop it. You're gonna drive away all my customers. After the commercial break, we will be asking guests from various fields about this turn of events. But there ain't any customers. Can it? My customers are on summer vacation too. Oh crap, I just realized our break's almost over. Oh, I know, and it's back to school. There are still 10 days left. Oh, that's a lot. I want to go somewhere, but we can't just leave Futaba-chan alone. Some things still concern me, too. Like that research. Oh, did you just get up? Good morning. <gasps> <laughs> yeah, you stay behind she's me, girl. Cautious of us. Oh, she's so cute. Why don't we go upstairs? If any customers come, she'll be even more afraid. Why don't you go with them, Futaba? Have fun. It's about time my regulars show up anyway. So I don't want you guys loitering around my store. We're not loitering, we're having drinks. The fact that there were no damages due to the hacker's actions is but an afterthought. It's that guy! The issue I want to make clear is the attitude of the police. And more importantly, the government. I like that he's still just a distinguished man. <sighs> what do you mean? Are they doing their best to find an effective countermeasure against these phantom thieves? Is it not the government's duty to create a society where its citizens can live without worry? I don't know. It seems like you're just afraid we're going to jump into you. Unfortunately, the current cabinet is powerless. As such, they should be disbanded. I believe now is the time for me to risk my political career in hope of making a new reality. A new political system that goes beyond parties or factions. An ideal country of peace and order. This politician seems quite promising. I have to agree. I hope he can work to ease the anxieties of the elderly. What do you think, boss? Hmm? Oh, sorry. Uh, I wasn't listening. Oh! Ah! Oh god, my head! Ah! Oh, I guess I'm gonna level up size social link. So the Phantom Thieves only stole the heart of Futaba Sakura? And Mejid was in turn defeated by her real-world hacking abilities? This does correlate to the facts as we know them. If he's telling the truth, then Wakaba Ishiki didn't commit suicide. Did a third party target her life with the goal of destroying her research? Wakaba's death was two years ago. That also coincides with when the incident started occurring. 
Does this other Metaverse user that Matarame and Kaneshiro mentioned really exist? I don't know. Sounds like they stole her stuff and killed her. I mean, come on, it's obvious. Earlier, I briefly mentioned about those psychotic breakdown incidents that have alarmed the public. All of a sudden, people will lose consciousness or become violent. A situation as incomprehensible as that can't be explained away as troubled social conditions. I suspect that these cases are all connected to a larger, man-made plot. The method involved always muddled the explication, but your story has virtually confirmed its viability. Although I wouldn't have expected a new criminal to come to light from your testimony. What did your group think of this other Metaverse user? Um... I want to say a true criminal, but I don't know. I don't know who, we don't know who it is. We just know it's someone else coming in, but not doing anything. I don't know. True criminal? How self-centered of you. <laughs> the Phantom Thieves tamper with people's hearts without asking consent. How is that different? Shit, I should have picked the middle one. <laughs> well, no matter how you thought of them, there can be no doubting your resolve. Are those incidents because of you or someone else? Either way, I will get to the bottom of this. You feel like my bond with Say is growing deeper? How so? You get you to believe me? I wouldn't say that. All right. Now, let's move on to your next crime. Kunikazu Okumura. Okumura, not Okumura. Okumura, say it right. You should know who he is, considering what happened. Your testimony regarding this incident will be serious. I'm sure you understand why. Answer my next question carefully. What did you do to this Okumura? Mm. Story been updated. Well, at least we're in the next part now. So, how many palaces is that now? Four. To think the cognitive version of a person would transform into such a horrible monster and attack us. That means our enemies aren't limited to shadows. I thought the other people were just victims. Like the slaves at the castle or the walking ATMs. I love that Futaba has a bowl of something. Even though they seem to be alive, they're only part of the backdrop. The environment. In other words, the palace ruler determines the form and strength of their cognitions. I would have loved to ask Futaba's mother how far along she was with her research. Research, huh? She was looking into that cognitive science stuff, yeah? If we put together all the information we've gathered up to this point, abuse of cognitive science can lead to death, and it may even relate to the psychotic breakdown incidents. Considering the cognitive aspect, I sense a strong connection between it and the metaverse. On top of that, the research might have been stolen and used by someone else. You mean those guys that showed Futaba-chan the fake suicide note? If that is the case, those people are unforgivable. Hey, Futaba, is there anything else you can remember? She is quite difficult. That smell. Come on, no fair. Hey, can I snag a bite? Meanie. Why don't we take a short break? Food! I've been thinking. Even if Futaba is a genius, could she really crush an international hacker organization that easily? The one who taunted the Phantom Thieves was a guy in Japan. I knew the Medjed members in Japan weren't anything special, so I wasn't worried. How do you know that? Because I'm the founder. Um, what do you mean? Should we take that literally? Yep, it was only me at first, back when I was referred to as the Hacker of Justice. But since I stayed anonymous, a bunch of guys from all over the world started using the name. And those were the ones committing cyber crimes. It was a hassle to expose all of them, so I just left them be. 
Uh, so Futaba was the true Medjed, and we were freaking out over some weak-ass dipshits? <sighs> you should have told us from the start, Futaba. I discarded the Medjed name a while ago. I'm Alibaba now. Futaba, what do you want to do now? Since you know our secret, we'd like you to join our team. Okay. Just like that? This may even ensure our investigation of mementos goes along smoothly. Well, I guess. Well, Futaba's real amazing. She's gonna be a big help for us, huh? Say, Futaba... God, this is like, this has got to be one of the first Persona games where most of the female cast is like, Oh, God! I don't know which one I want to choose. They're all cute and they're all, they all got their own things. How did you find out about us? Secret. Where did you learn to hack? Private. When did you obtain the nav? I refuse to answer. Futaba-chan sure is unique. Still, it'll be a problem if she doesn't open up to us some more. At the very least, we need to be able to communicate normally with her. What should we do? Uh, she's okay as is. I feel like, I feel, I feel like I have to say this that way she'll like that. Mm, that's okay. Uh, that ain't gonna fly. First, we'll need to help her open up to us. If we each spend an entire day with her, maybe she'll get more used to being around us. I see. We do have the time thanks to summer vacation. I like how she's just like, huh? We can begin tomorrow. Let's go to the beach. There'll be tons of people there. Plus, we got totally dried out in that desert. That's a great idea. I forgot I hadn't gone to the beach yet. Uh, excuse me. I'll come by tomorrow. See you then. Let me help as well. I don't have anything planned. Thanks. We can set a schedule with everyone else depending on when they're free. Okay. Don't look at my reset really poster. Do this. Don't look at it. Don't no, don't mind it, girl. It's, it's all right. She's just, it's just there. <laughs> It'll be a disaster. <laughs> Good luck. Why me? Uh, that's funny. That was cute. Stress is the enemy of beauty, you know. Oh god, a catchy. These the two mysterious confidant abilities I have are these two. How can I stay calm about this? I understand how you feel. Thanks to the incident with those hackers, people are calling us incompetent. And on top of all that, the Phantom Thieves are claiming justice is on their side. Don't make me laugh. Don't be mad because we're doing the job you can't. Measured was dealt with by either the Phantom Thieves themselves, or some avid supporter. There are no tracks whatsoever, so they must be quite skilled. Either way, the general public recognizes the Phantom Thieves as the subjugating party. They're gaining support and influence much faster than we could have anticipated. It is indeed an abnormal situation. I'm beginning to suspect mass manipulation of some kind. It's even possible that a powerful person is behind them, plotting the psychotic breakdowns. If only I had realized sooner. It's rare to hear you speak in that tone. For the sake of my justice, I won't forgive them. I would like to say if Naoto was here, she'd be on our side because we have personas. Hey, I've heard some people talking about us on the train home. They're saying how awesome they think the Phantom Thieves are. I've heard things too. It's becoming a huge topic of conversation. To be fair, the casualties from a measured attack would have been massive. It's no surprise they revere us as for pretend preventing it. Uh, good to hear. Yeah, it's really all thanks to Alibaba. You were a great help. It was nothing. Oh, whoa. Oh, she just popped in all of nowhere? Oh, that reminds me. Remember the stuff about ATMs and banks just stopping? That wasn't Medjid, was it? 
No, that was totally separate. So people were overreacting to mere coincidence? Either that or those rumors were never true to begin with. Hmm. You seem to be quite talkative in these conversations. Is that so? I'll shut up then. <laughs> He's like, uh, um. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh god, she's talking in emojis now. I don't think I get it, but I'm pretty sure she's angry. You gotta apologize, Yusuke. Me? Why? <laughs> hey, is this really going to be okay? I'm worried about how things will be from now on. Oh, what? God, when does when do I get to level up with Morgana? I feel like it's been a while. <sighs> Training Futaba is going to be a lot a lot of work. More than stealing someone's heart. I... Oh, he's not gonna let me do anything, I bet you. Now that my fan... Now that's my Phantom Thieves. I knew they'd pull it off. This definitely improves the justice of the Phantom Thieves. Uh, you may be right. Right? It feels great. Even the guys who have been criticizing the Phantom Thieves basically have to accept them now. The news has been spreading like wildfire, too. I'll give it an extra boost on my site as well. I bet the approval rating will be through the roof tomorrow. Look forward to it. Why is he... Why is he of all people getting excited about this? Well, the news really did draw a lot of attention. I can't wait to see what happens. I bet you I can't do jack shit right now. Oh, wait. Let's see. You have any info that can I turn into an article? I'm at Crossroads right now. I'll be... It'll be anything, so come talk to me. Oh, yeah, seems to be waiting near the bar. You want to go see her? Oh, I'll decide later. Oh, can I actually do something right now? Is Morgana not going to be a pain in the ass about it? Let's see. Oh, yeah! Wait. Conda? Nope, she's not. It's not up with her. You know what? I need to go to the underground mall. I need to buy some stuff for my plant. The plant's dying. I need some stuff. But I don't want to work at the flower store right now. I want to. Ooh, wait, hold on. Oh, this is an accessory shop. No, I don't want to buy accessories. I wanted to buy something for Kawakami because she's freaking hella expensive, but I feel like spending sixty thousand on her. So let's let's go here. No, I don't want to work. I want to do some shopping. Welcome. Um, I need some bio nutrients. Ooh, that's expensive. Get yeah, three. There you go. Cork Parker or Cork Park. Oh, no. Nah, yeah. Okay, let's go to the crossroads. And let's go talk to Ouya. You sure come here a lot, darling. I don't really mind it, but keep yourself a check, okay? <laughs> oh, I'm really starting to like doing the voice for Lala. It's so funny. You just gotta speak to Ouya, dollface. You're not gonna work at my bar. Not today, ma'am. Okay. Ugh. Whenever you want to come work for me, just come whenever. <coughs> oh, I didn't mean to shoot smoke in your face. Sorry about that. Let's talk to Is you. this weather a result of climate change? That's not what you said in your text. It's another hot summer this year. I bet we're going to break some record temperatures. Oh, God, I hate hot weather. Oh, God, I hate it so much. Although I'd be pretty happy to. They oh, wait, she's drunk. Although I'd be pretty happy that these records stay broken. Still. This time of year is the best for a nice, refreshing cold one. Take a seat. Any new info? Yes, I have a little in my party. What are you gonna do? Are you gonna hang? Yeah, yeah, of course. We'll get her oh? Seriously? Where do you get this stuff from? True believers are scary. Hey, you want a drink? I'm so drunk right now. Hmm. A fan site? Are you being a fan of a official auto website? I didn't know it was so popular with high school kids. I haven't been paying much attention to it. But if it's newsworthy, I guess you keep tabs on it. <sighs> the Phantom Thieves must be really bored if they're going after small time criminals now. I have a theory that they're all some minors. They're all minors. And their leader is some simpleton dying from boredom. Uh, you shouldn't make exceptions. You might be right. <laughs> Miners couldn't do that stuff. You shouldn't make. You might be right. She might like that. Right? Then I don't have any real proof, of course. Well, I'm not really interested in 
reminding you of entertainment articles about whatever feds caught on. But they do really, they do really well, right? Some journalists worried here, some seem frustrated about that. Journalists? Oh, you mean the cow and the others? Shit. You'd really let me in with those hyenas, huh? Don't insult me. Give me another drink. People at work call them paparazzi behind their backs. But me? I'm a real journalist. I'm sure you are. Hey, I wasn't looking for some kid to butt in. Shut up. <laughs> okay. Hold on. I think it's better. Oh my god. I'm sorry. I'm just. I can. I can make myself laugh because I. But I'm entertaining myself. Uh, okay. Entertainment articles are all about silly copy. The truth doesn't even matter. Nobody wants to read real news. Yeah. <sighs> Maybe you should quit. No. I've got my reason for staying. But at this rate, you. If I quit now, I'd be the same as declaring my partner guilty. Damn it. Join the responsible. What a joke. She didn't do anything. That's why I can't quit. And why I never give up. What happened? It had nothing to do with you, kid. But thanks to you, I've had more time to focus on my investigation. I'm going to write an article that you really enjoy. Thank you for this a sign of my appreciation. <laughs> I can see it now. Exclusive. Behind the incredible fan thieves. Down down one one for justice. How's that sound? <laughs> Don't worry. I'll take it seriously. After all, that's what I promised you. Yeah. But deal's going smooth. I like this combination between the bartender and her. All right. <laughs> oh, it's funny. Is she a weird though? Coming all the way to Shinjuku at night. I knew you were going into that sextorium. Ring, ring, ring. Oh, wait, wait. That's my cute little. That's my cute little ringtone. Do you like it? Oh, hold on one second. Hello? Mm hmm. Wait, what? I can talk with him? Really? Oh, no, I'm not drunk. What are you talking about? Work? Nah, I'm already off the clock. Sorry, I have some urgent business I need to attend to, but just put this one on my tablet, son. Well then. See ya. Gee, she's such a child. She gets so excited the moment something comes up about her favorite Simon. Anyways, you should be getting to home too now, dollface. Uh, yes, I was able to pique Oya's interest in the story yet. Yeah. My, oh, my charm went up. Oh, shit, that's a good. That's a good amount. All right. See ya, honey. <laughs> I, I should have added that. Oh, yeah, we gotta level up Igor. Oh, being taken back. Oh, taking out oh, all these chains of confinement. Ah. Oh. Huh? Yo, Igor, bro, what's going on, man? Nothing Our much. master would like a word with you. Stand up straight and listen closely, inmate. Whoa, why is Justine getting all like Caroline like? It seems you freed the heart of a frenzied girl and saved her from her haunted past. <laughs> Another step has been taken to rehabilitation. You are progressing quite nicely. Our master bestows words of praise upon you. You'd better feel honored. By the by, more curious information has found its way to your ears. A scientist's research. It seems that world may secretly be known after all. Furthermore, that very research has been stolen and is now used by those with malicious intent. I wonder how this will change the approach you take toward your rehabilitation. Uh, who stole the research? <laughs> you know, bro. Allow me to grant you a new power, worthy of your current self. Though you have my aid, be sure not to let your guard down. Otherwise, you may get swept off your feet. Yep, I feel my bond with Igor growing. Alright. It's at seven, so... 
<clears throat> if that's four palaces down, that means by what? The last palace, it'll go up? You know, it's the whole seven deadly sins thing. Like, I feel like that's... There's only seven palaces left. Or, sorry, three. We shall meet again in the near future. Time to go, inmate. No. No. What if I want to fuse right now? No! <laughs> like, I'm going to force you to wake up. Oh, booyah. Look at the 60%. Getting up there. Now everyone can be happy. Yeah, everyone. Yeah, everyone's happy. A landmark for justice. Pissing off all the freaking authority figures. They're just like they're doing their job and they make us look bad. Oh god, school starts soon. Oh no, ten days. Wait, nine days. Well then. According to Yusuke's schedule for today, huh? I haven't seen them. What happened to them? Beep, 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 beep. Futaba, can you open up? Uh, open, open what? The front door. Why? Won't you come to El Zero? We're in front of Futaba's house. You want to meet? You want to meet here at Arnold LeBlanc? Isn't that more comforting? Y you never mentioned this. It'd be nice if you could hurry down soon. It's scorching hot out here. You demon. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we're meeting up immediately over at Futaba's. Makoto's really going, going about this seriously. Well, I mean, I did clean up her room, so I feel like I can go over. I should be able to, you know, hang out. What the shit is on her face? 